With the 19th pick in the 2015 NFL Draft, the Cleveland Browns select Cameron Irving, guard, Florida State. Cameron Irving. Well, guys, the Cleveland Browns go with a guy who's not too flashy, but Cameron Irving, a center out of, of, of Florida State. Guys, what do you think of this one? Uh, I think, you know, you can never ha not have offensive line help, and it all starts there, in my opinion. you got to protect the quarterback, and I think Irving really helps out the cause. He's a center. He'll, lead, he'll get behind the veterans in the offensive line, and I think he'll really help, help this team out. I'm a big fan of the pick. Uh, we mentioned for the Browns a lot of it. I think for them needs to be uh, best available. And I'm not sure if Cameron Irvin is necessarily best available, but I think he's really, really good. Uh, an interesting fact here, uh, you know, I was reading up on him. He actually played defensive line for a large portion of his career, made the conversion over to center. That's where they felt he'd be uh, a little bit more useful. And when you think about converting a D-lineman to O-line, that shows that there's going to be a lot of versatility, quickness, and speed. And for a center where run blocking is your main thing, I think that's going to be real important, and it's going to help him a lot. I think I'm with you. I mean, like, I think, look, for the most part, uh, Florida State did struggle to run the football for large portions last year. Certainly wasn't all on him, but I think collectively that offensive line was not at their best last year. But I think for the most part, when you're the Browns, sometimes it's not the flashiest pick, but you've got to take care of business in these key positions. They get Danny Shelton. Now they get Irving. I think they're two guys you could certainly expect to make, make maybe not the most explosive impacts, but they're certainly guys who address holes for a team that, let's be honest, needs to get better in every area that they can. But on the clock, Kevin, your Philadelphia Eagles, right now, I know you're sweating it out a little bit. You want a specific player. Is it going to happen? If we don't get Landon Collins, there's about a 75% chance that I walk out of the studio. The only 25% is because Demerges will kill me, perhaps. <laughs> but uh, I just, I, I don't know. I just, every time we pick, I get really nervous. Chip Kelly really scares me. I'm kind of getting tense right now. This is There's just so much riding on this pick. And I think the pick is almost in, so let's get an end to this right now. Yep, it's in.